Hey Fossil, this is Miss Jones, and I'm here to tell you about some changes that we've made to advisory this year. The advisory team and I went around to staff and students and polled them to find out how we can maintain the integrity of our classroom while allowing you to use academic time for academic reasons. Here's what we came up with. If you need to travel during advisory, there are three reasons you can do so. If you have a pre-arranged pass from your teacher, if you need to use the restroom, or if you need to go to your locker. Another change this year is that we have classes that are spending their time in the flux labs. So when you are in the hall, please make sure that you're keeping it in a quiet environment. Academic time, do's and don'ts. Miss Jones, I need to go see Mr. Gallagher right now. Daxon, we're in the middle of academic time. Do you have a prearranged path? No. Well, you should have thought that about that before you came to advisory. Don't leave advisory to go see a teacher without making an appointment. Hey, Mr. G, can I come in during advisory to get help on a project? Absolutely. Will you sign my prearranged pass for me? Of course. Do ask a teacher prior to advisory to set up an appointment and get a prearranged pass. Hi, Ms. Jones. Is it okay if I work with a friend on a project in her advisory classroom? I can't have you go during academic time. Um, is it okay if I go print something from the Flex Lab? We have classes meeting in the Flex Lab. Really, during academic time, the only time you can travel is if you have a pre-arranged pass or if you need to use the restroom or go to your locker. Don't leave advisory to wander the halls, meet friends, get snacks. Do focus on the academic work that we are giving you the time to accomplish. Thank you.